Okay, before I show you this video that I made originally for Facebook, I want to preface it with something because this video did well on Facebook, got a lot of views and shares, but it was also very misunderstood. And I wanted to make sure that I was extremely clear before you watch this upcoming video because there's a lot of comments calling for me to, for the Philippine government to mark me as a person that should not ever be allowed to come back into the country. Some people actually said that. People were quite angry with me and my point of view and like most of the comments were comments that I agreed with and they thought that they were disagreeing with me. But in fact, I agreed with them. <laughs> so I wanted to just clear something up. I'm about to talk about something that happens more in Filipino culture. It happens more in Filipino culture than most other cultures because of utang na laob, which is, which is your amazing Filipino cultural belief that you should pay your parents back for all that they gave you when you were a child, which I totally agree with. Um, what I don't agree with is when parents take advantage of that and demand so much of their children and take away pretty much their future without ever really loving them in the first place. It's a small minority of parents, but at the same time, I believe that the Philippines is more susceptible to falling into this trap because of the respect that they give their elders. So elders then take advantage of that and they demand so much of their kids even when they didn't love them in the first place. And they say, oh, well, you have walang utang na laob, which means, you know, you have no idea what I did for you. And it's like, well, you didn't do a lot for me. So for some parents, they were, they were abusive. For some parents, they just look at their kids as money. And I think that's not a good thing. So when I say that this is a, something that I don't like about the Philippines, I'm not talking about everyone, not at all. I'm talking about a small minority. And I say that multiple times in the video, but I just wanna make sure, crystal clear, before we start this video, that I am not talking about every Filipino, okay? In America, people like to say that we have a gun control problem because there's lots of mass shootings. Is everyone in America going around and murdering people with, a, with, a, with an assault rifle? No, they're not. But we say that it's an American problem or it's, an, a prob it's a problem in America because there are so many mass shootings compared to other countries. And that is all that I'm trying to say here, okay? The vast majority of Filipino parents are amazing. The vast majority of Filipinos are amazing. I love it here, I'll never leave, probably. Um, but what you're about to see is something that I really believe in. It's something I still believe in, even through all the bad comments. And I want to make that very, very clear, okay? All right. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy the video. Hi guys, it's Tom here. Normally I talk about what I love about the Philippines. Today's video is sadly about something I don't like. After five years of learning about the Philippines, I found so many things I love about the country. I love the respect they give to their elders. I love how kind they are. I love how resilient they are. And I love how they somehow find joy in practically every situation. However, like one thing that I would change about the culture is how parents can sometimes treat their children. I was reading a Reddit thread recently about a 24 year old Filipino who was giving 10,000 pesos per month to their parents. That's fine, right? After a few months though, the parents started demanding three times the amount of money that that particular person was giving to them. It doesn't end there. I've seen this happen with my own eyes many times while living here in the Philippines. As you can tell, I'm a foreigner, an American to be exact, and this practice floors me because we just simply like do not do that at all in America for our parents. Like first of all, you brought us into this world. Like it was your choice to have us. And second of all, we have our own problems. We have our own bills to pay. We're probably racked with student loan debt. And and and, and not to mention we're half your age basically. Like you're supposed to be the ones that have it together financially, not us. As I kept reading this Reddit thread, somebody said no. Tell your parents that you are going to save money so that you will not ask money from your children in the future. It's about time to change our tradition that parents treat children as a milking cow. Let me quickly clear something up. Helping your parents is not a bad thing. I actually think Americans should be more willing to help out their parents and take them in in old age like Filipinos do. I made a video about this recently. However, this can go too far. Someone on this Reddit thread said, some parents raise their kids so that one day they will save them from poverty or give them a better life. Screw that. 
They should have realized by now that they failed their kids as a parent by having the burden of responsibility passed to their kids. Always remember, you are not raising your kids for your security, but rather you raise them so they are secure, which in return makes you feel secure and satisfied as a parent. I literally could not say that any better. My mom likes to tell me that I am one of her investments, along with my other siblings. She did not mean that from a monetary perspective. She did not mean that I'm investing in you so that one day you give me money when you're older. She meant that metaphorically. She invested her time into me because she loves me and because she also wants me to make an impact, a greater impact on the world. Her investment is actually in her community, in the world, in, in her country. And I wanna make one thing clear. Like, I don't think all Filipino parents do this at all. Most Filipino parents are incredible. I've seen it with my own eyes. They raise their kids with a lot of care and kindness and tenderness, and they will do anything for their kids. Like, that's the way that most Filipino parents are. And I also wanna make it very clear that we should help our parents when they are in need. If you aren't doing that as a child, then you've truly forgotten all the things your parents have done for you to get you where you are today. But where I will draw the line is, and where I want to draw the line is, parents shouldn't demand money from their kids. And then when they don't get that money, they shouldn't hold a grudge against their kids for that. Love, to me, needs to be at the center of this. You give money to your parents because you love them, not because it's demanded. And your parents raised you because they love you not because they want money from you later on. When love is no longer at the center of this, that's when problems come. And isn't it funny how most of the problems in the world are because of that. When love is no longer at the center of things, then that's when the problems actually happen. That's when we get transactional. That's when we start to focus on money too much and not what it really means to be a good parent or a good daughter or, or son, you know, or child. You need to respect your kids also, that's what I think.